All right, today I am welcoming Mr. Bass to Grady TV. How are you doing, Mr. Bass? I'm doing fantastic. Uh, as you know, we had a super entertaining, action-packed day yesterday, and I'm, I'm pumped full of adrenaline from it. I, I can't believe I was able to sleep a couple hours last night, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, I've seen some of the footage. Uh, we'll get into that a little bit uh, later, but let's start off from the beginning here. Whereabouts are you from? originally um i was born in philadelphia pennsylvania in uh 1967 i'm 57 years old uh, my birthday is february 23rd i'm a pisces and um my mom had me when she was about 21 years old um she had a uh, a whirlwind romance with uh my dad that made me and um, they both had very aggressively outgoing personalities and um, they fought quite a bit and uh, got divorced when I was about two years old. When I was two years old, my mom moved back in with her uh, parents in Jamaica Estates, Queens. And I was there for a little while. Um, my mom met um, my stepfather, Ron Itzler, at um, Sugarbush Mountain uh, skiing, snow skiing. My stepfather um, legally adopted me, and um, we moved to Fort Lee, New Jersey. Um, Fort Lee, New Jersey is uh, one side of the George Washington Bridge is um, like 180th Street in Manhattan. The other side of the George Washington Bridge is Fort Lee, New Jersey. So Fort Lee, New Jersey is considered the absolute closest part of New Jersey to Manhattan. So I grew up in northern New Jersey, but like kind of a Manhattan person because Fort Lee is so close to Manhattan. My dad was a big lawyer in, in New York City. We moved into a building called Mediterranean Towers at 2000 Linwood Avenue in Fort Lee, New Jersey. And um, you know how like you have to reach a certain age to have memories? My memories really start uh in Fort Lee, New Jersey at like the age of maybe like three, two and a half, three, something like that. What age were you when your mother got remarried? I was um three, three and a half years old. Do you know your birth father at all? Do you have any kind of relationship with him or uh great question. Um my mother uh died when she was forty seven uh, years old. I was 26. Uh, so my mom died really young. My mom was gorgeous, super cool. Like My mom was amazing. She was like so many people's favorite person in the world. When my mom had her untimely death to cancer, uh, my, um, my father that made me reached out to me. And uh, with my conscious awareness, I met him for the first time in my life. Um, when I was 26, 27 years old, like shortly after my mom passed away. So we met, I think in, in uh, Delray Beach, Florida or something like that. I, um, I was living in Florida at the time. Uh, I went to uh, Nova Southeastern Law School. I graduated from there and I was down in Florida running uh, a very successful business I had called M2 Communications. I believe it was the second largest phone sex company in America for several years. And I had it for almost a decade. Uh, did like $20 million a year. I netted three to $5 million uh, after expenses and stuff. I was kicking ass, but I had lost my mother. I, I, like I was making crazy money, millions of dollars a year. But uh, I was super unhappy because I lost my mom. So I met my dad, but I was a bit of a mess. 